My sister got me onto the magazine New Pathways. She'd heard a radio programme, uh, uh, and Alex Higgins, I think he's called, a rugby player. He is the president of um, the MS Society or something. I don't know, I can't remember. But she'd heard this radio programme, and she said to me, oh, it was a really interesting programme, I'll send you the website. And that's how I got onto New Pathways magazine. And then they reviewed George's, George Yellenick's book. And that's the first time I'd heard of OMS. And then when later on uh, the retreat was advertised, I immediately rang the magazine up and said, I want to go and please put my name down on the list. And they told me they would let me know uh, if I was lucky enough to get a place. And I was so... Um, I just wanted to get on that retreat so badly, especially being in Germany. I just wanted to be with people to speak about my illness with other English people. And it was so important to me to be able to do that. I feel it's an essential part of my life and, and that I've got contacts now and I'm networked with people who have got the same illness. I don't feel alone anymore. I feel supported. I feel um, hope a lot of hope um, for the future, and, and I'm not frightened about the future anymore. I don't have that fear that I had at the beginning. I don't have that visions of the, verse, the worst scenario. I see a better scenario for myself, and I'm convinced that it's going to be good for me. This is unique, I think, here with our group, this group. It's so, it's so important. It's, uh, it's a lifeline, I think, to people.